It's match time. Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith with you as always to describe it. And we're looking forward to something special today. Well, I think so, Martin. I hope these two teams won't disappoint us. Lille playing today and they play Paris Saint-Germain. Paris Saint-Germain, Alan, how about uh, their contribution to this match? What do you expect? Well, they're in a Champions Cup position, but they'll be disappointed with that because uh, they were fully expecting to be challenging for the title. Hey, listen, there's still plenty of time to go and they might still do that, but I think they're going to have to step up the game to make those improvements. Paris Saint-Germain uh, blessed with the best defensive record in the division. It's a wonderful asset to have, isn't it, on the road, coming to a, a ground like this and to know that you really have got a good defence. This is the Lille lineup. Vincent Enyama starts in goal. Sebastian Corsia starts, looking to continue his good form at the back. And they just go with the one striker up front. Paris Saint Germain. This is their lineup. In goal, Alphonse Areola. Thiago Silva plays with Marquinhos in central defence. Angel Di Maria starts with Lucas on the flanks. Edinson Cavani is the main striker today. Sebastian Mitre is our official today. So the first half about to begin. Sebastian Corcia attacking well here. Well, it will be a throw in. Good anticipation by the opposing player there to read the direction of the throw. Well, we're still calling them Paris Saint-Germain. Alan, I know there's a big move afoot within the club to be called Paris FC. They want to simplify their name. Uh, there is in the lower levels of uh, French football a Paris FC already, so I don't know how they're going to work that out, but PSG still for us. Yeah, and a team now that's consistently uh, challenging at the top of European football and long overdue, really, because Paris has been punching beneath his weight for a long time. Well, There's good progress with this attack. Really strong tackle, and the ball's gone out for a throw. Angel Di Maria... And in goes the cross. Well, he's got his fist to it. Throw in for Paris Saint-Germain. Well, they're in a good position here. Matuidi. Defender to it first. And here's the shot. The goalkeeper comes out with a punch. Yunus Sankare. Play back. Here the challenge is a good one. Cavani! Great work from the goalkeeper. <laughs> Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Well, they passed their way up into a good position here. And then just lost the concentration, lost the ball as well. And they've got to work hard to try and get it back. Looking to play his teammate through. He's got his tackle in, and the ball's gone out now. Good position, they've worked this attack very well. Into a quite a dangerous position now. Good tackle. Angel Di Maria. Cavani. Oh, he spotted the pass and cut it out.
Okazawa. Baratti. Sebastian Korchia. Quick into the tackle. And the result is going to be a throw. Rio Antonio Mabuba. Attacking now. Good try with that back heel. Well, this is how this team can play. Sustained attacking football, but when they lose it, as they've done now, it's just a risk that they might get caught out. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they still got the ball. Being moved around nicely here with this passing game. That'll be a free kick. Tweedy. It goes out wide again. And the cross coming in. He's better usually at crossing than that. It was a defender who got there first quite easily, actually. Baratti. Doing well to keep the ball. Another shot! That's a Tweedy! Motta! It's a high-class header and a world-class save. Well, you could argue it was a good height for him, but what reflexes, what agility he showed there. It's good to know how much longer there is. This wasn't always the case, certainly when I started commentating. We've got two added minutes. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Yunus Sankare. Well, we're halfway through. And we haven't yet got a goal to bring to you. Nil nil. I think the coach will be considering his options on the bench. Here we go with the second half then with Paris Saint Germain. Cavani trying to find an opening. Shots on here. Well, saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch. And a corner given by the referee. Now across Angel Di Maria. Done well to get it wide. Not done so well with the delivery from the wide area. Cavani! Got in the way. Into the attacking third. And oh, that's broken up by the defender before the cross could come in. Lille ready to make a change now. Try to... Free kick given. There's some movement in the dugout. We're going to get a change here. Baratti. Now Tweedy. There's some potential in this move. This could be danger with this passing. Well, it was considered controlled attacking play, but it's come to nothing in the end. Lucas. Pass one defend. To take the lead. Terrific stop. And it's out for a corner. Fantastic save by Enyama. That was top class. Thiago Silva! Well, no scraps for the attackers to feed on from the goalkeeper that time. Hung on to the ball well. Patience is the name of the game at the moment. Trying to pick out Di Maria. Di Maria! Flag up for offside, it's not going to count. Well, really good organisation from the defence, and it was offside looking at it. This is another angle on it, Alan. Well, it looked like the timing of the, the pass and the run was spot on, but the defence squeezed, and I think they just caught him off.
Matuidi. Verratti. A lot of defenders between them and the goal, but they still got the ball. Well, this is great teamwork, the way they're knocking the ball around. Marco Basha. And the substitution is for Lille. We're watching a very evenly contested game here. Neither side being able to dominate the ball. No, I mean, they've both got really good ball players, people that can keep hold of the football, and, and we have seen that today. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. Cavani. That could have... Lucas! Oh, that's great. And the wait is over. It's a fine goal. They've worked away at the opposition. And now they've got their reward. Nicely taken. And patience has paid off finally. It was almost an air of, well, we expected this when the goal was celebrated. Nothing too extravagant. I think they know they're the better side and they expect to win. No, I think they do. There's a certain swagger to their play. Uh, and in a self-belief, they know they're better and they're showing it out on that pitch. So, finally, the stalemate is broken here. And we have a goal. Civelli Saw the pass coming and got there first. Good forward play from them. Makes a challenge here. Morgan Amalfitano. Going to be a change here for Lille. Very impressive, the support for this team. If only the team could be quite so impressive themselves. Yeah, they're doing their bit, the supporters. They really are, so... just Lucas! Well, but for this goalkeeper, the game would have been long over. Isn't it just? He's been their best player by far. Look at the watch. And that will tell you six minutes to go. Here's a chance to attack. Played into the middle. Saw the goal and went for it. Off the crossbar. And back into the penalty area. And there's the interception. And that's a clever pass. Assistant looking very confident about that one. He flagged. The referee gave the offside. Thiago Mota. And the decision for the added time is three minutes. Into the attacking third. A Twitty! Great work from the goalkeeper. We're down to the last minute here. And the referee says that's enough. Paris Saint-Germain have won it. Really good game to watch. Good attacking play. Edge of the seat stuff for the spectators. It's what the game's all about. Yeah, and there's nothing better, Martin, than seeing quality strikers go about the work. And uh, we certainly did today. They were at the top of the game. Well, a real roller coaster of a match here. And the visitors have won. <laughs> but they haven't won by the way they normally win by defending so well. Yeah, nothing if not efficient, this team. We saw them again out there. Top form.